few days ago, I spoke about 96% of your new website viewers are not ready to buy. Well, there's one thing, there's one important thing that gives you just three seconds to grab the attention of that future potential guest to keep on reading. And in today's episode, I'm going to explain to you what that is and why so many of you are getting this wrong right here. My name is Mark Simpson and I give hosts all over the world the tools, the tactics, the training, but most importantly, the confidence to go and get more direct bookings. And tomorrow I'm hosting a very special live video um, on the internet. It's going to be a fifth anniversary party of the idea of Boostly. Uh, I would love for you to be part of it. Booster.co.uk forward slash party. Go leave your email address and I'll send you all the exclusive links on where you need to go. But the one thing that you need to do, the one thing that you need to make sure that you get right. The one thing that you've got three seconds to do to get right is your headline. So the headline is the first thing that the user sees when the website loads up. It's what's called above the fault, okay? Now, again, one of the most common headlines I see is your home from home, okay? Very clever, very nice, very warmly, but everybody does it. So you've got to make sure that you've got a very strong headline. It's gonna grab the attention. And the best headlines that to use is are the ones that identify a pain point in the user. So for example, that user, that future potential guest could be looking for a bed and breakfast in Scarborough or a bed and breakfast in Whitby or a bed and breakfast in Insert Your Town. So a real good headline to, to, to try would be, are you looking for the perfect B&B in Insert Headline? Because they, look, they are looking for a B&B and they've come across your site. So they're going to go and they're going to ask themselves, they're going to answer themselves in their head. They're going to go, yeah, I am. Find out more. So again, you do the headline. Are you looking for the perfect B&B in? And then underneath, you can put a little bit of clout. So award-winning um, accommodation in Whitby. So then instantly it goes, okay, we're on the right track. You back that up with a real nice picture. And I've talked about picture and your first picture so many times on this podcast, but you back it up with a nice picture of your bedroom. And what that's going to do is going to strike a little note in the brain of the future potential guest for them to scroll down to find out more so again the headline is everything now the problem is so many people get this wrong you're not copyrighted i don't blame you which is why with boostlycontentcreator.com i have given you access to a spreadsheet where we've got hundreds of different website headline variations depending on who your target audience is so if you are focused more on family friendly as your customer avatar as your ideal guest we've got headlines for websites for family friendly. We've got ones for rural, we've got ones for solo travelers, adults only, uh, city center, beachfront, apartments, villas, guest houses, you name it, they're in there. The Boostly content creator is only five pound a month and you get access to that spreadsheet as well as social media content for every month, video templates, email templates and much much more five pound a month it's an absolute bargain uh, we've nearly got up to a thousand members so please do come and join boostlycontentcreator.com and you can grab access to that word uh, that <laughs> sheet template that you can use tomorrow okay uh please come and join us for the live party tomorrow would love to you to be a part of it boost.co.uk forward slash party uh if this is the first time tuning into this welcome every day in 2021 i want to have a daily episode where i give you the host all the tactics the tips and the training totally for free um all you have to do for free is just a way of saying thank you if you're watching this on YouTube, smash that like button, hit it very, very hard, and tap it as many times as you can, and then tell another host about Boostly. The more times you do that, the more the algorithm will share this out to other hosts, Airbnb hosts, Verbo hosts, Booking.com hosts, hosts all over the world to show them not to rely on these OTAs and how to get their own direct bookings. Today was a website tip, tomorrow could be anything. So if you want me to talk about a specific tip, email mark at boostly.co.uk. Thank you very much, and I'll be back tomorrow. Having a blast, gonna get it on the Boostly podcast. Boostly like Bruce Lee, cause it's so hard and the tea is loose leaf. Making up those rhymes, don't write it, just do it loosely.